What up guys, it's Lee here from Blue Top Productions and today I'm bringing you another Be A Pro FIFA 15 episode, episode 2 and oh boy, what what can I say about this episode? This episode was actually quite frustrating yet fun because we actually get off the benchmark in this episode but probably because the episode is called Why Did It Happen To Me, you guys are a little bit curious. So obviously something good and something bad might happen in this episode, so there's a little bit of a teaser. But anyway, guys, thank you for coming back. As always, if you're new to this content, thank you for stopping by. If you keep coming back for more of my Coventry career modes and all my Coventry content, thank you very much for your support. Please leave a like on these video, guys. It's much appreciated. Also leave your comments. I enjoy reading your comments. They're absolutely amazing. Also, if you... I have not seen episode 1, there's a thumbnail on the screen right now to take you to the playlist of this whole new entire series and also the playlist of the Coventry career mode in FIFA 14 which I was the manager and this time I'm actually a player so it should be a lot of fun. But anyway guys, with that being said, we're getting straight into this episode and the first one is, yes. Here's one of the first downsides, guys. A disappointing debut for McAlpin. After a poor start, it was clear that both Coventry and Coventry City's manager were not entirely happy with McAlpin's performance. It's not the end of the world, but I would have liked the transition period for his adjustment to be a little bit quicker so that he can, excuse the pun, get the ball rolling, um, began the Coventry City's manager. But... You can't rush things, I'm sure that he will come into his own, but it, this will be an ongoing process. So obviously, starting off kind of rough, my uh, professional career at Coventry, you know, uh, shrouded with disappointment at the moment, which is quite unfortunate. Uh, but yes, as um, of the last episode, we had uh, Marcus Tugge get injured and he actually broke his elbow. And he'll be out for two months, which is kind of frustrating. But guys, we're going to get into our first lovely game. And unfortunately, we had to sit this one out because we were exhausted from the Ipswich game, which was in the cup. And this was actually against Barnsley. So let's see how we do. The joys of sitting out and not enjoying life. Oh, but anyway... Here we go. Let's see how we do against Barnsley. Oh, Daniels is injured right away. That's always a good sign. So here we go. Still nil-nil. This is looking pretty meh at the moment. Still nil-nil. Still nil-nil. Hitting in the 40th minute. Man. Oh, and O'Brien's been sent off. That's brilliant. So this is not looking like a good game for us. Hopefully we can do some sort of good. No, we got a goal by Madison. That's awesome. So we're 1-0 up with 10 men. That's impressive. Can we win this? Oh my gosh, we won with 10 men. That's proper impressive. Moving on from that, guys, as you can see, we won with 10 men, but it's been at a cost because Billy Daniels is out for four months because he's actually uh, hurt, ruptured his crucial ligament, which is pretty, pretty bad. I'm not going to lie. It's not very pretty. And uh, hopefully he can make a speedy recovery. But anyway, we're going to get straight into our next match, which is against Sheffield United. And I actually get to play in this one, so I'm really, really looking forward to it. Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of League One. It's Coventry City against Sheffield United. Of course, the game being played under lights this evening. Let's head straight off to Coventry. Here's your Coventry team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Well, this is a game from the League One. I'm Martin Tyler and Alan Smith is with me. Pleasure to be here, Martin. Can't wait. Alan, what do you make of the home side here today? Couldn't have wished for a better start, could they? Two wins out of two and a team that we all fancied for promotion. who is going to referee the game today, Gavin Mansfield.
Right. Game on, children and gentlemen of all ages. Here we go. Oh, right. Down the line. Good ball. Here we go. Okay. Cut inside. There we go. Good pass. Right. This is nice play. I want it back. I want it back. Yes. Yes. Oh, good save, keeper. Oh, my days. I can't be that um, disappointed. I'm having more shots, which is good. It's just they're straight at keepers or they're accurate. So I'm accurate. So I'm happy with that. But here we go. Let's get in the box. Right, that's over me. And that's not properly away. I'm going to call for this if I can get it. Here we go. Here. Yes. Right, turn. Yep. Shoot. Yep. Oh. Rubbish. Accuracy of a flamingo. Can't seem to get it in the back of the net. Come on. Get it back. Get it back. Get it back. Good tackle. Come on. Get your foot stuck in. Well done, Johnson. Good pass. Right, I'm putting you through. There we go. You're through on goal. Is that... Get in. Get in. It's finish. Oh, my days. McQuaid. How? How did you miss? Beautiful over the ball. Ta oh, rubbish pass. <laughs> Here we go. Good tackle. Send me, John. Good. Oh, I'm in. I'm in. I'm shooting this. Bang. Oh, yes. I'm off the mark. I'm off the mark. Get in. Oh, that was a good goal. I hit that on the volley. I'm well happy with that. I can, I can literally say that. What a touch that was. And what a shot. Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that to the bank every day. My first professional goal. I'm off the mark. Those people who were disappointed with me, hopefully they won't be disappointed now. Right, here we go. And again, and again. Good cross. Oh, here we go. Can I score again? Oh, hit it straight at the keeper. Oh, I'm hungry for more. Right, good back heel. Here we go. Send me. Oh, look at these cheeky back heels. I'm in. I'm in. Finish. Oh, straight at the keeper again. Oh, man. And yes, they clear. Come on, clear it. There we go. Good. Right. Half time. I'm happy. I'm off the mark. I have my first goal. So I cannot be that, you know, I'm happy. We should win this game, though. We've been playing amazing. So we should win. Come on. Come on. Yes. Oh, there we go. I'm in. I'm in. All right. Take your time. Take your time. Yeah, that's... Oh, off the post and in. That's it. That is what I'm talking about. Second goal. 51 minutes played. Come on. That is what I'm talking about. Oh, I'm so happy. I had to make sure I got it. You know, the cheese of other goals that I haven't scored so far in this series. That was a well-taken goal, I have to say. And oh, I'm happy. Two goals for the good. Come on, John. Good ball. Here we go. Can I get a hat-trick? Oh, I hit the post. I hit the post. So that looks like it's the end of the game for me. Right, guys. So that is the game uh, we played against Sheffield United in the bank. And as you can see, uh, they actually say early in the season, it was uh, clear that in the post-match interview with Lee McAlpin, he was clearly pleased with his first brace for Coventry City. I'm happy to be on the score sheet. I'm uh, setting it, settling into the team and I'm pleased to be here. So there we go. There's all my doubters. All my doubters can just, you know, fudge off. I am settling in and two goals to the good is very, very tasty. But with that said, guys, we're moving into the next game I played. And that is against Leighton Orient. A very, very interesting squad, not going to lie. Uh, but let's see how we get on. Hello, welcome to League One. It's Lake Orient against Coventry City. Unbeaten in the league, early in the season, mind you. We're heading straight to Lake Orient. Here's your Coventry team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Hi there, everybody. Martin Tyler here. Alan Smith is alongside me. League One football for you today. Alan. Delighted to be here, Martin. Looking forward to it. What about the away team today? How do you feel they will measure up? It's not always easy fulfilling expectations. I know the crowd here are fully hoping that their team could uh, vie for promotion, and that's the way it's turned out early on in this season. Just need to keep it going.
Here we go. Whistle's blown. Let's get this game underway. There we go. Out wide. Let's keep going out wide. Good ball, Barton. All right, let's cut back in. There we go. It's Jackson. Oh, go on, Jackson. Go on, Jackson. Go on, Jackson. Send me. There we go. Oh, yes. Okay. Here we go. Ah, oh, that's not a good effort, but I'll take it. I'll take it. You know, I'm hungry for more goals. I'm hungry. Come on, Barton. Give me a good ball. Oh no, good ball indeed. Come on, finish. Oh, straight at the keeper again. Down the line, no, now, no, now, now, yes, good ball, okay, let's cut inside, there you go, have it, all right, I've got this, oh, I've kept it, cross it, there we go, get it, oh, defender clears it, oh, man, he should have had that, oh, and that player's down, fantastic, the injury bug continues to hurt us, and, and Jackson's down, so McQuaid's coming on, fantastic, come on, guys, let's short, let's get this short, here we go, come on, oh, tackle, yes, all right, go, McQuaid. That's you. Finish this, mate. Wow. Wow. That, that, that's just... I set you through. Look, you're one-on-one -on -one with a keeper. Penalty spot. And you miss it. Ugh, we get a corner from it, but you miss a glorious opportunity. That's frustrating. How we do? Oh, the headers. Headers, no. Penalty? Yes. Awesome. We get a pen. I'm happy with that. Come on. I have to take this. No, John Fleck is. John, you better score it this time, mate. Come on, mate. Yeah. No. What? What the heck? That didn't cross the line? I can't believe we've had penalties and John Fleck keeps missing them. Here we go. Good. A good attack in football. Send me. Send me. Oh, come on, lads. I was through Barton. But anyway, it's half time. We should be 1 0 up because John Fleck missed another penalty. I should take the penalties from now on, man. All right, put me through. There we go. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. Shoot. Oh, come on, my son. Get in. What a strike. Man, I hit that pretty, pretty darn good. Like, that was, that was a sexual strike. Bang. Look at that. Look at the curve. It comes back. It curves away from the keeper and then comes back. Phenomenal. Do something good. Oh, this is nice play. Nice. Oh, look at this. We're keeping it. All right, here we go. Oh. All right, let's pass it again. Here we go. Shoot. Oh, no, pass to me. Yes. Oh, I hit the post. Oh, my days. I wanted him to shoot it more than anything, but here we go. Let's keep it going. There we go. Come on. Do something with it. Nah, it's going out for a corner, isn't it? Oh, my days. Oh, my day is done. I'm coming off early. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, guys, so that is another game in the books, but we're going to go straight into another game because it is against Doncaster Rovers, a very decent-ish side in League One. But let's see how I get on in this game also. Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of League One. It's Coventry City against Doncaster Rovers. A mouth-watering early season clash today. First against third in the league table. Settle down, this could be fantastic. Let's head straight off to Coventry. Your Coventry team is Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Welcome everybody, Alan Smith alongside me, Martin Tyler. Nice to have you along for the ride. Our two good teams, aren't they? First v third, still fairly on in the season, but uh, I think they'll fancy themselves to be still there towards the end. And, uh, and there's not too much to separate these two teams. Keep your eyes on this one. And the man who is going to referee the game today, Gavin Monksfield. <laughs> Doncaster Rovers. Can they stop the goal-scoring machine, also known as Lee? Here we go. Let's see how we do. Here we go. Good passing. Look, this is nice. This is this is this is quite tasty football, and we lose it. Right. Here we go. Come on. I'm open. Good pass. Here we go. Let's cut back. Come on. There we go. Oh, I'm in. Oh, oh, ref. Penalty. No. Oh. Oh, it was worth the shout, I think, guys. 
Down the line as always, but no options. Barton. Barton, good ball. John Fleck, send us. Good ball, John. Come on, get that, get that, get that, get that, get that. I'm there. Oh, got shrugged off it again. Come on, we need to close him down. We need to close him down. That's perfect. Here we go. Finish. There we go. Oh, oh that is a terrible shot. That is so bad. There we go. Good pass. Right. Cheeky through ball. Oh, he's in. Finish. Oh, and he missed. Oh, he's offside as well. How, how far? Okay, yeah, he is offside. But what a miss this is. He had an open goal. And what a miss. Good win again, Barton. All right, go on. Turn. Turn. Keep going. Shoot. 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 Just shoot it already. Oh, my gosh. You shoot it when a defender's there. Bloody shoot it, McQuaid. Jesus. Okay. Wow, he kept that on. Oh, and it's halftime. Okay, so half time. Uh nil nil. Um it's been quite a frustrating uh, first half, but hopefully we can get away with the win. Hopefully. Let's get one in from this corner. Go on. Yes? No? Oh, I thought that was in. No. Come on then. Here we go. I'll take it. Oh, right, let's work this. Boom. Oh. Oh. Man, I thought that defender was going to be closer. But man, that shot was close. Look at this. Oh, close, but not close enough. Come on, guys, it's tackle. Good tackle, Johnson. What a rock. Good pass as well. All right, I'm giving that. There we go. On your bike. Go on. Go. Go. That's a beautiful pass. Finish. Oh, what a save by the keeper. We're putting on tons of pressure, so let's keep going. Go on, Barton. Oh, I keep going offside. Right, send it. Go on, John. Well done. Right, here we go. Come on. Come on, be open. Oh, man, that was bad. Barton, I'm through. Here we go. Here we go. Cross it. Yes. Come to come to the ball. Come to the ball. Okay. They're showing me. So, yeah, it looks like my game's done. Oh, hopefully we can get a win. So, that's another game in the books, guys. But here we can be seen in the papers as being hailed as a game changer. He's playing out of his skin. I knew he could perform at a high level, but he's done exactly what I've asked him to do, which must... Um, applaud him for said a very happy Coventry manager look at that over after like a couple of games they've changed their time of me being disappointing to absolutely loving me which is fantastic uh, the next unfortunate thing is yes uh, Jackson got hurt in that game and uh, he's going to be out for three months which is kind of unfortunate with a broken ankle so as you can see it's only McQuaid and me up front at the moment which is kind of frustrating because everyone else has been out for ages but here we go. Here's our upcoming targets against Doncaster, which we just did. We're supposed to have two goals, maintain a goal conversion of 38%. Um, we're supposed to have one assist, and my match rating has to be 9.0. So in Doncaster, I did not do anything, which is quite unfortunate. But yeah, as the next couple of games come, like Notts County, uh, Colchester, and Oldham, hopefully I can perform. And as you can see in the last one, that we did for our upcoming targets. We did fantastic. Look at that. We achieved our average match rating. We got our goals. And yes, I converted 25% um, of my chances when I only needed to do 24. So just doing it, lads. But still, hey, I'm doing it. I'm happy with that. But here we go. The next game, Notts County FC in League One. Can we get a win after that unfortunate disappointment with Doncaster? Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of League One. It's Notts County against Coventry City. So it's the early league leaders we're watching today. Can they take another three points to maintain their position? So let's go straight to the ground. Here's your Coventry team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Well, this is a game from the League One. I'm Martin Tyler and Alan Smith is with me. Pleasure to be here, Martin. Can't wait. What about the away team today, Alan? So far, so good for this team, Martin. We all expected them to be up in the promotion places, and so it has proved. The referee for this match is Grant Lindham.
Okay. Uh-uh. 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 Come on, let's count. Two. Let's beat them. Come on, lads. Come on. All right. No. Yeah, I tackled him. Oh, man. Barton went flying. Uh-oh. Okay, this is looking dangerous. Uh-oh. What is our defender doing? No. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. Three minutes in. And they do some sweaty cheese like that. That's pretty dangerous. Oh, that is frustrating. That is frustrating. Look at that. Open. Where's our defense? Come on. Here we go. Come on. Down line, down line, down line, down line, down line, down line. There we go. Good ball, finally. All right, I'm crossing this. Oh, darn it. They keep tackling me. Come on, let's get it back. No. Is it out for... How? How is that stadium? That's impressive. Right, come on. I'm open. I'm open. I'm open. I'm your top goal scorer. Come on. Oh, my days. McQuaid, hit this. All right. No. Oh, fine. Goodness gracious. Man, I want him to shoot more, but he just wants to keep passing it. Okay, guys, I'm through. I'm through. I'm through. I'm through. Good pass. Okay, okay. I'm cutting this back. Oh, you're open. Have it. Oh, my gosh. You overran it. You overran the ball. Guys, tackle. Put a foot in. We can't lose this game. Come on. Do I have to do it? Yes, there we go. I got the ball back. I'm just going to go wide. I'm just going to go. I'm not the quickest player, but boy golly, I'm going. Oh, that player missed me. I'm through. I'm through. I'm through. Have that. Come to the ball again, guys. Come on. Man, this game is frustrating as fudge. Come on, boys. Here we go. Good pass. Come on. There. No. Half time. This game has been so frustrating. Guys have not been putting away their chances. And, man, we're 1-0 down. This is very unfortunate. We're playing okay-ish football, but we deserve to win this. Come on. Yes. Yes. Good ball. Come on. I'm going. I'm going. Yes. I'm through. I'm through. Finish. Oh, what a save that is by the keeper. That is an unbelievable save. I was through on goal. Yeah, and he saved it with his knee. Barton. Come on. Good pass, Barton. Oh, man, referee. Have a word. Thank you. Have a word. Yellow card. Thank you. Mullins, you dirty player. Goodness gracious. Look at that. How are you surprised? Look at that. He went. F I went flying. I'm open. I'm open down the line. Right, I'm going to run. I'm going line. 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 Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm down. Clutching my leg. Oh, no. Don't say I'm injured. Oh, my gosh. No way has that just happened to me. Yes, guys. So, as you can see, unfortunately, we came off with an injury. And it says, hey, I want to know. We're updating your league expectations due to your injury. Which is kind of frustrating because I need to get back to full fitness. But the problem is, guys, it's really, 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 really bad news. I'm going to be out for three months. Three months. I was out for three months because I torn my hamstring. That does not sound pretty, period. But I'm out for three months. That is very, very frustrating. It's episode two and I've already picked up a huge bloody injury. That's kind of frustrating. But anyway... Um, on a lighter note, it says in the papers, McAlpin continues to perform. Before I got injured, this is what the papers unfortunately had to say. Right. Sales of shirts with the name McAlpin will surely be rocketing since he's arrived at the Coventry City. Well, uh, with a number of good performances recently, Lee McAlpin must have made his name the first on the team sheet. Coventry uh, City's manager was quick to heap praise what was to become a very good signing for the club. We've been looking at Lee for a while and I'm pleased we got him. His performances recently have been excellent and he's having a positive influence on those around him. There we go. Look at that. Just a little tug down to get to the next line. But yes, look at that. I'm continuing to do great performances, but now I'm injured. I'm injured. I'm out for three months. This is kind of unfortunate. And Coventry City's woes about me, which is kind of unfortunate with three months out of action that's frustrating so as you can see my league objectives have changed so now they want to keep my average at 8.4 which is okay um, they want me to at least get 19 goals I'm predicted to get 23 
which is okay. And then to set up goals, which is to set up six really for assists, I'm projected to have zero. That's hilarious. So basically, I'm just finishing and not passing. Hopefully, I can do a little bit better. But as you can see, uh, also maintain less than no, um, than 29% uh, on my goals for my shot conversions. At the moment, I'm at 15. So that's not that great. But hopefully, it'll be a lot better. So, guys, with that being said, we're going to do a fun little montage of uh, music. Uh, I didn't. I just had to sim a ton of games because I was injured. So here we go, guys. Hopefully, you enjoy it. This is the period of games I was out for. The first game we had was against Colchester, which, you know, Colchester uh, in the last couple of games they've drawn and lost and drawn. So let's see how we get on. And we win 1-0, which is fantastic, with uh, Barton scoring, which is fantastic. Our next game is against Oldham Athletic. Again, as you can see, um, they haven't had a great set of records, but hey, John Fleck gets a goal, but we draw that game 1-1. And unfortunately, we uh, drop points at Oldham. But here we go. We're against Gillingham now. And they've had three previous results have been draws. So hopefully we can get a win. And as you can see, they've got one of their strikers injured. And yes, we draw 2-2 with Quaid and Kibalri, I think that is. Or I don't know how to pronounce that guy's name. He came off the bench and scored, which is exciting. So here we go. Uh, Bristol City. What can we do? We lose 2-0. Ouch. Emmanuel Thomas with two goals there. That's kind of unfortunate. Here we go. Fleetwood Town. They've had back-to-back uh, uh, -back losses, actually. So hopefully we can pick up a result here. That'll be fantastic. So here we go. Yes, we actually win 2-1. John Fleck got two goals for us that time, which is fantastic. Here we go. We're against Chesterfield. And I hate simming because I'm injured. But here we go. 2-1 uh, to us. And that's Powell and Willis with goals, which is good. Or Pew, sorry, with goals, which is good. Here we go. Paint the Town Red Trophy against Rochdale. Hopefully we can get a win and stay alive in this cup. How do we do? No, we lose 1-0. <laughs> Unfortunate. So we're out the cup. Here we go. Another league game. We're against Preston. Hey, we, got, we won 2-0. And it was Clark and McQuaid getting a uh, victory for us, which is great. So that's 2-2 at the moment, which I'm really, really happy about. Here we go, our next game uh, in the League One as well. And we win 2-0 again. And again, it's John Fleck and Cool. I can't pronounce that guy's name. I feel really bad. I don't want to butcher his name because of my dyslexia. But anyway, Port Vale we are against next in League One. Continuing our lovely form. Yes, we get a 2-0 win and two goals by Tudgate, who is now back from injury, which is fantastic. But here we go. We'll take a quick look at the table. And as you can see, we are top of the table with 10 wins, two, uh, three draws and two losses, which is actually really, really good. So we're going to continue with simulation because I'm out for ages and we're against Swindon Town. And here we go. Let's see how we do against Swindon Town. We lose 2-0 and yeah, that was Thompson and Barker scoring for them. But here we go. We're against Crawley Town. We have to be Crawley, surely. <laughs> I just rhymed accidentally. But yes, we win 3-2. John Fleck again with two goals. And Marcus Tudgay gets a, another goal, which is fantastic. But look at this. Since since my injury, commentary have uh, found a new talisman in Marcus Tudgay at the beginning of the season. Few uh, fans expected John... Uh, not John, sorry. Marcus Tudgay to shine like he does right now. It is... Now up to Coventry City's manager to motivate and allow the player to perform at this level as long as possible. Yes, you need to because I'm coming back from injury. But here we go. John Fleck again is hitting the papers because John Fleck has been putting in some great performance of late uh, for Coventry City. He's emerged as a real leader out on the pitch and the club and fans alike will be hoping he can keep this level up over the next part of the season which we're hoping because i'll be coming back soon but we'll go straight into our next game which is against mk dons again i'm out injured so i won't be playing this so here we go will we get a win it's one nil no we finish with a draw which is two two a goal for haynes and a goal for mcquade which i'm happy with but here we go as you can see i sit out at that draw so basically guys i am coming back from the sounds of it a draw left both managers feeling uh non-pulsed about the game but commentary city's manager had more reason to ponder as he had to make a decision on whether to bring back recent injury victim lee McAlpin or keep him wrapped up in cotton wool for another week the boss decided not to risk this player and he'll hope he can bring him back for the next game so guess what will i be back for the next game no, it's against Peterborough and he sat me out just to make sure that I was going to be fine. 
But look at that, Swanson gets a goal right away, but we do lose this game 2-1, unfortunately, to Peterborough, which is kind of unfortunate. But the good news is, as you can see, I have some upcoming targets, so I'm coming back from being injured, guys, finally. And as you can see, it's November. Goodness gracious, I've sat out for a very, very, very long time. But the next couple of games are against Scunthorpe, Warsaw, Bradford City, and Rochdale. So hopefully we can get some wins and start picking up some momentum. Uh, they want me to keep an average match rating of 9.0. They want me to score four goals. Uh, they want me to contain uh, a goal conversion rate of 59%. And they want me to at least get two assists, which, you know, is possible or... Yeah, I'm just going to be putting the ball in the back of the net. I'm sorry that I might not pass it as much because you've seen what McQuaid and a few of my other strike partners do when I pass it to them. They're afraid of shooting, and when they do shoot, they're terrible. But anyway, with that being said, guys, that is going to be the end of the episode. So thank you guys for watching the entirety of this episode. I hope you are enjoying it as much as I am. This beer pro mode is a ton of fun. I love uh, making all these episodes at the moment it's such fun it's a whole new dynamic to what i was doing with fifa 14 so hopefully you guys are enjoying it if you're still watching this and you haven't checked out any more of my content you can click on the channel link there uh, and check out more of my board video and miniature game content uh, if you've really enjoyed it you can subscribe by hitting that subscribe button don't forget to like and comment below on this video guys it'll be much appreciated um if you haven't seen the first episode you can hit that last episode thumbnail to go watch it and when the next episode is live you can click that thumbnail right there to go check it out out because it's going to be a doozy i hope and yeah i'm on facebook and twitter guys the links are in the description don't uh drop us a like on facebook or follow us on twitter i'm becoming more active and releasing teasers uh on facebook and twitter of like what i'm doing screenshots of my editing and stuff like that so hopefully you guys can help support us on facebook we've just got over 100 likes let's keep smashing it i want to keep i want to get to 150 likes that would be absolutely amazing but anyway guys until next time Take care and have a good and, and oh yeah, when the sky is blue. Come on, come on.